Hello YouTube, hope the fan ain't too noisy. We're doing a little work before it gets too hot. It's only going to be like 80 today. These are nasty. Not putting them down for the price, but you see where I sand it off? The, see that molding lines, that seam? I see where I've taken off the edge. Back up. And up here over the edges. I'm taking all the sharp edges. Can, can you see that stuff in there? Like right there. And the fill these things, they, they just, they, they always feel greasy. And I took a scotch pad to this, you can see the copper showing through the chrome. I'm not kidding, I don't know if you can tell it on camera. So I don't know if I'm going to buff it up with some polish and try to make, take it down to bare steel or just, it's just going to be an experiment. I've already painted one for a Sunday to shop video, so uh, you may have seen it, may not have seen it, but we're going to give this a try on these really cheap screwdriver. And we're not worrying about having any brush strokes. We're going to sand in one straight line using mostly drywall screen. Because technically clear coat on it look good enough, but yeah, that's what it takes. You can't use 220 sand. If you use this 220 sandpaper, it's going to clog up with... Because these are more like rubber instead of plastic. So, let's get to work. We'll come back when we have it painted. I'll probably show you before we clear coat it. Have it painted first, then clear coat it. So, here we go. Just hang in there. Stay tuned. And we are done. That's two coats of light paint. I thinned it down. Then I sanded it with my scotch pad and took some of the roughness out of the hand paint. And a couple of quick coats of clear. So. But I'm sure you can tell that I just left that brush with the scrub pad because you can see the copper in there. That's a cheap chrome plate. It's just a working tool. But it's smoother. It doesn't have that icky feeling on the handle when you grab it. Because it almost felt sticky, greasy. Especially when it's hot out here. It's like a plastic, in between a plastic and a rubber. But there you go. Thanks for watching. I took a couple of pictures there when it was sanded and before the clear coat. I think you can tell the difference. So we're out of here. We're gone.